Hello my lovelies, welcome to Erica's Magical Projects. I'm Erica and my most magical project of all is to celebrate Beltane, my favourite time of the year. Beltane is the changeover from the 30th of April to the 1st of May and this lovely stuff is called Mayflower. There's an old English proverb that says, never cast a clout until May be out. And what that means is don't put your summer hat on until you see these flowers in the hedgerow. So the summer hat is on and I'm spending the weekend outdoors. May Day is a very old holiday in this country and one we still celebrate. It's traditionally a celebration of fertility, but also it's become representative of workers' rights, of the people. It's always been a holiday here, no matter what kind of government has been in charge. And we've still got a bank holiday. And this year, Beltane falls on a Saturday night, which means I've come out to a beautiful seaside campsite to celebrate it and to see if I can raise some happy spirits. It's so sunny and beautiful. And let me show you where I am, the most beautiful place in the world. That is the sea down there. And this is an old garrison. Let's go for a walk. Isn't it beautiful? No matter what's happening in your life, if you can get sit with nature for a little bit, it can just calm your spirits. All this is happening even when I'm sitting at home feeling sad, and that gives me an immense comfort. The sea doesn't care whether I'm sad or not. Why should I? I'm searching for the flower to put on my wheel of the year. There are so many candidates in the hedgerow, it's hard to choose. Oh, the bluebell. Oh, it's so hard to resist the bluebell. But what are these ones? I love this naughty little flower. It grows everywhere. Considered a weed, but I absolutely love it. Oh, gorse, you're always in flower. And I shouldn't forget the grasses that are also in flower. Just different types of flower.
I'm back in the house now and I had a fantastic Beltane weekend. The sun was shining most of the time and even when it rained I didn't mind because we had a nice big fire. I'm definitely getting older because it took me a few days to recover from that camping trip. And now I'm back I've got lots of energy to complete my next project which is to take this thing down and to add another segment to it. I've already decided what I'm going to put in. I'm going to draw Glastonbury Tor. Glastonbury Tor is a very special place to me. It was the first place that I discovered that magic really existed. It was on Glastonbury Tor, one Beltane, that I discovered that witches and druids and fairies were real and there was a whole other world that existed on top of our own. And after that May Day, I was completely changed. I couldn't really see the world the same way again. And so to celebrate May Day, I'd like to put Glastonbury Tor on my Wheel of the Year. And underneath, I'd like to put a little bluebell because the bluebells were really beautiful in the woods. They really gladdened my heart. <laughs> There we go, all finished. Some bluebells and glass and tour in the background. Well, thank you so much for joining me for this most marvellous of festivals and come back next week because now the sun is out, I am going to be doing some yarn washing and I can't wait to see all the beautiful colours hanging on the line. Until then, remember everything that you hand make is magical.